time. During the during the kind of height of the uh, or the fall of last year and the spring of this year, I was doing a bunch of private backyard shows, and uh, Kevin and Laura were so sweet to um, have a handful of them in the backyard. We had Megan Slinkard a couple times, and John Doe from the band X was in their backyard, and uh, and he's like, "Man, I want to get Tim Bloom. I'm a big Tim Bloom fan." And I was like, "Just hold tight, and like, let's just do a show show and invite a bunch of good-looking people." And he goes, "That sounds like a good plan." <laughs> so, uh, give it a one more time for Kevin and Laura for having us. This Um, I see there's a lot of familiar people. Um, who's ever been to a show I've put on before? Yeah. Oh, wow, cool. Well, and if I haven't met you, my name is Casey Turner, and, and I do this. And I used to do a lot more of this uh, before last year when uh, I just took the year off. I just didn't feel like doing shows for about a year. But um, also, it wouldn't be a Mother Hips isk kind of show without our good friends Dallas Hillary and uh, Chicken Man back there who brought us all that beer. That's pretty awesome. Um, I, I was thinking, I think the first time they ever brought beer to a show um, was with uh, uh, Tim and Greg back in like 2010, and they brought the hips hella, like they have a beer, like beer not enough to them because they're super awesome, and uh, I was like, who are you guys? They're like, we're the Sierra Nevada guys, just step aside. <laughs> I was like, you guys are going to sell all this beer? I, we didn't talk about this. Like, no. We're going to give it away. <laughs> and I was like, there is a God. <laughs> So give it up for Dallas, Hillary, and uh, Chicken Man. Um, and uh, thank you guys so much for, um, our, I want to thank our friends, uh, Wendy and Pete, who checked you guys in at the door. Yeah. Good for Wendy and Pete. They're, they're our frontline workers tonight. Um, and thank you guys for uh, being cool, keeping your mask on in between sips. We're obviously in a very tight space, uh, but we're going to be fine. We're all vaccinated, and I appreciate you guys doing that. Because, God damn it, if we have another year of no live music, I don't know what we'll do. Probably more backyard shows. But um, I just want to say thank you guys. Uh, and it, it's San Francisco, so it's so easy. You know, like, um, we're not, like, we love Chico, right? But it'd be a little trickier up there. <laughs> Let's see that fax. <laughs> I got tetanus shot. Um, <laughs> just kidding, I didn't get tetanus. They have a fake tetanus shot card. I'm <laughs> Dave Chappelle up here? I'm like, it. Sorry, Tim's just out there waiting to play, and you guys are waiting to see Tim. I'm just like, blah, blah. But hey, um, I do want to say thank you so much for supporting live music. Um, to be able to bring Tim back to a place like this and sell it out and see all your, I know you're smiling, I think, under the mask uh, faces. Um, it's such a, uh, your, your support keeps us alive, literally. Um, and uh, we just cannot do it without you guys. So thanks for sticking around and, and, and supporting live music still. I really appreciate you guys so much. Um, after the show, Tim does have some merch over here if you want to check out the vinyl and CDs and some t-shirts. Um, he'll uh, have those for sale. Um, he's just going to do one set. Uh, so their restroom is just right back there. Watch your step. There's a weird step going back there. I put a bunch of weird gaff tape on it. Um, my friend Jordan who owns August Hall said that's totally up to OSHA standards. So <laughs> we're good to go. Thank you, Jordan. Uh, I'll give you his email if you have any issues. He's... He'll take care of it. Um, uh, but I also want to say really quick before I bring Tim out, um, I've only got a few more shows left this year, and uh, I think you guys would like at least a couple of them. Uh, this coming Thursday, uh, November 18th, up at Hot Monk in Novato, I've got Loudon Wainwright up there. And if you haven't seen Loudon Wainwright, dude, you got to see Loudon Wainwright. He's unbelievable. And then on Saturday, November 20th, also at Hot Muck in Novato, this amazing band called the Coffus Brothers are going to be there. I think you guys know those guys because they back up Tim all the time and they play on this record. And uh, they're, it's a co-headline bill with uh, AJ Lee and Blue Summit. And if you haven't seen AJ Lee and Blue Summit, like if you're wondering like who's going to be that next band that's going to be at the Fillmore like next year, it's going to be them. They're unbelievable, and uh, it's their album release show, November 20th at Hot Mike in Novato. And then, uh, and then in December, I've got just two shows there. I've got um, the Sam Chase and the Untraditional, which I'm wearing, sporting my Sam Chase hat, and Megan Slankard and the Wreckage. They're playing my birthday party on December 10th at Hot Monk, and then uh, because I didn't have to have a birthday, I didn't get to have a birthday last year, I'm doing two birthday shows. At, <laughs> why not? Uh, December 11th, uh, Charlie Hunter and Scott Amendola are going to be there. So, all the shows I just mentioned are almost sold out, and uh, they'll be, it's a bigger venue, so there'll be more space to spread out, but KCTunnerPresents.com for all that information. Okay, are you guys ready for some Tim Bloom? Now, here's the deal. Usually when I have a touring artist come through, I always say, 
please give them uh, so much love like it's their hometown show. Go fucking berserko. Make them feel like they're at home. He is at home. This is a hometown show. So San Francisco, God damn it, if you don't make the roof fly off this place when he comes out, I'm never going to have him again. Just a moment. All right, guys. San Francisco, California. Give it up for the one and only Mr. Tim. Boom. I mean, I feel like we've already got our money's worth just right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not really yet. good. Not yet. <laughs> no, I know. I'm not off the hook yet. Yeah, <laughs> Thank you. Let's give a huge round of applause for Casey. <laughs> Now what'd you do with my guitar? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you brought it in. Brought it in for me. <laughs>